as you know, I've got a lot of pictures and I'm doing a lot of downloading and pictures and music and, and what have you. What you don't realize is that your computer could be under attack at that very minute. Well, please don't go away because our today's showstopper is called the Fix Me Stick. I'm so thrilled that we were able to get in a few more. I did not think we would have any left for this hour. The item number right away is 37006. How great would it be if you could confidently fix your own PC? That's right, fix your own PC without having to take it out anywhere. I wanna say hello and welcome to our very special guest, Corey Villan, who is here with us. He's the co-founder of Fix Me Stick. I've been hearing about it from Babish, our buyer, for probably a few months, and he's like, oh my gosh, you gotta get this thing. <laughs> so it's so good to have you with us, Corey. Thanks really, for really me. good. And I think you were, you know, you're my hero. Walking into the, the, you know, the dragon's den, oh my gosh. I get shivers every time I watch that because I think I can do live TV, but there's no way I could face those dragons. It was and very you did. And they all jumped on it. Yeah. Yeah, we were on Dragon's Den with the product with Fix Me Stick in January 2014. We pitched it. All five dragons wanted it in on the deal. It was an amazing experience. Yeah, but you have a lot of background uh, as well. You and your co-founder. How many years all together if you totaled it all up? Yeah, yeah my, my business partner Marty yeah. and I have worked for over 15 years in the internet security yes. business. So I did my undergrad in engineering at Queens. Then I went to Stanford for a year to do a graduate degree in engineering and then worked in antivirus for 15 years. So we built an antivirus product that we sold to large companies like Rogers. It was installed on millions of users' machines, and it was a good antivirus product, but we found that viruses were still getting by our product as well as all the other products out there. Wow. We also saw that it was painfully difficult to remove a virus once it got on the machine. And there, we saw that techies were, had a solution to the problem. They had these things called boot disks where they were able to reboot a computer from a different system, and I'll sort of show you how Fix sure. Me Stick does that in a little bit, but they were able to disinfect computers very effectively, but it was just really complicated to use, and so no non-technical users could use it. Right. So in 2014, or sorry, 2011, Marty and I decided to quit our jobs, and we started Fix Me Stick to try to take this proven technology that techies were using and make it really simple for everyday people to use. And it's now global. And it's now global. It's global. It's global. And you know what is so great? Yes, we know you can buy Fix Me Stick out there in the retail world, and it's great. Yeah, it's, it's a very different it's, version. It's a different version whereby you could actually fix three computers, all right, and you get, um, you know, a year, yeah. and then you're purchasing another year, which is, I mean, that's fine. Exactly. If it's going to do what you're telling me it's going to do, and I can do it myself, it's I would gladly pay deal. it. But here at the Shopping Channel, how would you like to be able to actually use this Fix Me Stick on five computers for, the li for a lifetime? Yeah. And the one price of $79.99 with no renewal. That's right. That's it's the cool. only place in Canada you can get the lifetime version. Yes. So if you go to a retail store in Canada or the U.S., you're going to pay $60, and that is going to cover three computers for a year. Then you have to pay a renewal every year for $45. Now that's still a great deal when you compare it to your alternative, which is to bring it to the corner computer shop. It's going to cost you north of $100 mm -hmm. per incident, right? That's per incident. Your computer might have two, three viruses over its lifetime times five computers. Right. So then when you compare that retail version where you're paying $45 every year to this version exclusively at the shopping channel where you have the lifetime of five computers covered so you're never taking out your credit card and paying renewal again. And how about four payments of $19.99? I mean, I mean, it is so sweet, but the fact is, I can actually fix my computer on my own. And I know there have been a lot of programs where you can buy, I'm sorry, I'm not tech savvy at all. I can find my way around my computer, but don't ask me to install anything because I'll mess up my computer. Now this product is designed exact for people like you. It's so simple in fact, that we put the instructions right on the back of the stick. I love that. Okay? <laughs> first, the first step's not there, so you have to remember it. You've got to take off the cap. So we yeah. do get calls every okay. week from customers saying it won't go into the computer, <laughs> that's so and that's because the cap is still on. So I've actually taken some of those calls myself. Okay. So you get the cap off, okay? Then all you have to do is insert it into your computer and double click run fix me stick. That's it, just double click. That's it, a bit later we'll run through sure. sort of how that works live. Okay, from that point, the Fix Me Stick does something very different than every other antivirus solution out there. The Fix Me Stick actually turns off your computer as the first step. 
So why is that important? So it actually turns it off. So when viruses slip by antivirus and get on the computer, they are now live. So the viruses are running. They're able to hide. They're able to fight back. They're able to disable antivirus. That's why it's hard for antivirus to clean them off. Fix Me Stick is completely different because it shuts down the computer and it reboots the computer from a system on the stick. So this has a whole system on it that can reboot your computer. Therefore, the viruses are inactive. Fix Me Stick is able to pick each of them off, clean them up, unlike antivirus can do. Restart your computer and you're off to the races with a so brand new computer. Oh, so it's, it, it's really better to do it at night, like while you're sleeping? Yeah, it, so one right, complaint, yeah, exactly. Most people do it at night. And that's, most people, some people complain, their one big complaint about the fix me stick is it takes a long time. So it might take three, four, wow. five, up to six hours. And that's because fix me stick is scanning each and every one of the files on your hard drives with not one, not two, but three antivirus engines that we've licensed from three of the world's largest security companies and incorporate it on the stick. So it takes a long time. But the good thing is, you don't have to be there while it's happening. Right. So most people kick it off, they just double click run fix me stick, they see that it's good to go, and then they go to bed, wake up in the morning, you see the final step where it explains to you what issues were found, or it tells you that your computer clean. It actually clean. shows you, It shows oh you gosh. exactly the whole I list. Mean, just a thought, just a s seeing it, yeah. I mean, that must just give you the chills, knowing all of this was in your computer. And I heard you talking about this earlier, that there are about a million new viruses. And growing. Yeah. Growing every day. Okay. Every day. Not every year when you think about it. Every day. So how can you keep up with that? I mean, you know, when you think about some of the, uh, the, the you know, the spyware software that you can buy out there. First of all, it's complicated. You know, and you'd have to be an absolute, I think, genius to actually buy something that is going to um, some of the things that you've seen out there before fix me stick to actually protect your computer. I think, I, I mean, I think this is probably one of the best things I've ever seen in my entire life. It works And I can do it myself. Yeah, it works extremely well. The reviews show it. Yes. Extremely easy to use. Do you mind if I just read it? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Reviews? Okay, five star. Okay, works. This product not only works, but comes with the best support I've seen in 35 years. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's we're, amazing. We're a Canadian company. Yes. We're in Montreal. Montreal. All of our support's in Montreal. It's all university grads. Wow. You can call us. We answer the phone. We'll guide you through any, any problems you have. If for some reason, let's say, you think the Fix Me Stick hasn't taken a virus off or your computer's still slow, you can call us. And with your permission, we'll remote connect to your computer and try to help you out. There's no cost. Again, you're paying for a lifetime here, so we'll never ask you to pull your credit card again. $79.99 lifetime and five computers. Yeah. I mean, this is brilliant. Can I, I'm just going to read one more here. We've used our Fix Me Stick five times now. It's so easy to use. It updates itself every time you plug it in, so you're always up to date on any possible threats. Yes, it takes a little bit of time to run a scan, but the peace of mind you have is well worth it in our opinion. The initial scan took about three hours, and subsequent scans took about two and uh, um, you know, half hours each. We already have an internal security program on our computer, but we were very interested in trying out this little gadget as an external one. We feel extra safe and secure now. So you know, what I'm getting from this also is you should also have an antivirus yes, program yes. anyway. So you, yeah, it's very important. You absolutely need antivirus. You need an up-to-date antivirus. Antivirus is great, and it's going to prevent most infections from getting through. Okay. And that's what you want. You don't want infections getting through in the first place. The problem is Virus writers are funded by billions of dollars of organized crime, mm. and inevitably, they find a way by your antivirus, and they get in there. Once they're in, antivirus has a hell of a time getting them off. The right. Fix Me Stick is the best way to get them off. So it's complimentary. Keep your antivirus, keep it up to date, also add the Fix Me Stick to the equation. So now, would we actually use this, um, Corey, maybe once a week, just put it in, just for safe safety? A lot of people ask us that. So there's some telltale signs that you have a virus. You might know you have a virus because you have pop-ups or maybe your computer's really slow or crashing or you click a link to go to one website and you end up in another one. So if you have one of these telltale signs, definitely use the Fix Me Stick. But what people don't know is the best viruses out there are actually designed to be silent, right? So once mm. they've infected your computer, they don't want to set off any alarms. They don't want you to know because then you're going to go remove them. Right? You're going right. to go bring it to the right. corner store or you're going to get a fix me stick. So they stay on there silently, very happily pulling off your credit card information, banking information. Oh, All this is to say, you really don't know if you're infected or not. 
That's why we recommend to all our users to run the stick once a week. Best case, you're clean. It's going to tell you that. You have the peace of mind. Or if there's a problem, it'll clean it. So most people add it to their regular routine, maybe a Sunday night, let's say, kick it off at night. It's done in the morning and it's part of their regular routine. You know, I think a lot of, uh, a lot of us uh, feel that when the computer gets a little slow, it's like, oh, well, you know. I've, People give up. Yeah, yeah, you know, I've done a lot. I've got a lot in there. It's probably, I mean, that's just the way it is, right? You don't we have to. We don't realize no. that there could be something. There's that, that, that silent, that burglar inside Coming that's up. scanning it through everything. Now, is the Fix Me Stick going to work on say all viruses and, and Trojans and, and malware, everything? Yeah. yeah, it's a great question. It'll work on all different types. It'll work on viruses, Trojans, malware, something called keyloggers. So keyloggers okay. are things that get installed on your computer and they actually record every keystroke and that's how they steal your oh, passwords and kidding. banking info and all that kind of stuff. So any type of bad file Fix me stick will remove. You don't have to think, oh, is this a Trojan, a malware? You don't really care. Mm -hmm. yeah, you want the bad exactly. stuff off. Exactly. I just want to get it out. Yeah. But I want to be able to do it, uh, do it myself. I love this animation, by the way. Let's take a peek. When your computer gets <coughs> sick, computer viruses happen to everyone, and they're painfully difficult to detect <laughs> and remove, leaving your banking and other personal data at risk. You don't have time to call your technical friends or take your computer to the shop. How great would it be if you could confidently and quickly fix your own PC and keep it that way? You can with a tool that the computer experts use, the Fix Me Stick. The Fix Me Stick scans your computer while it's sleeping, so the viruses are sleeping too. They can't run and hide the way they do from other solutions. Oh, and it's packed with not one, but three of the best antivirus engines in the world. So it finds and fixes your virus problems fast. The Fix Me Stick is ready to go right out of the box with no additional software or downloading required. So it's fast, simple, and because it runs separately from your PC, it can't mess up anything. Your files are safe. Make the Fix Me Stick your first response when there's a problem with your PC. Uh, we're going to do a really great demo, but I just want to ask you a quick question, Corey. Um, now, as far, how about if you have um, a PC that's like, say, I don't know, 10 years old, and it's yeah. downstairs in the, you know, the rec room, and it's all jammed up, and you're thinking, oh, one of these days I'm going to, you know, do something about it, but I still have a lot of information in there that I really don't want to take it down to the corner store. Can the Fix Me Stick help me out there? <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. The Fix Me Stick will work on pretty much any computer, so laptop or desktop, that has a USB port. Okay? Okay. That's pretty much any computer in the past 20 years or so. Oh. That's Windows XP, wow. Vista, 7, 8, 10. So pretty much any PC in the past 10 years. It doesn't work on Mac yet. We're working on that, but any Windows computer. Okay, now another question. Now, how about if I get up in the middle of the night and there's something that I have to you know, get to the office, can I use my computer while that the scan is happening? So that's a good question, no. You okay. Can't. So when the Fixby okay. Stick is running, what's unique about it, right, is the Fixby Stick shuts down your computer Perfect. and restarts it from a system on the stick. So you can't do any web browsing, you can't do your emails. That's why most people do it overnight. Right. If something urgent comes up, you can always stop the scan. Okay. You know, do your work and then restart the scan. Okay. That's not a problem. But when the Fixby Stick running, it has completely taken over the computer and deactivated all of the good files, which would run Windows, and the sure. bad files. Okay. Now, marbles. Yeah. <laughs> so here I'm going to use a sort of illustration to explain to you sort of antivirus, okay. fix me stick, how they're different, and hopefully this will make some sense. So these are my son's marble collection. I have four young boys under 10, Dude. so my house is crazy. Well, I guess it is. Crazy in a good way. Yeah, and I guess it is. these are their marbles. So these marbles represent the good files on a computer. So that's okay. your critical Windows system files, your photos, your oh. wedding videos, all that good stuff, all right? All tax stuff. Tax stuff. All of All that. the things mm. you don't want the bad guys to get. Yeah. And this box around here is representing antivirus. So antivirus is great. You need it. And it's very effective at blocking most viruses. Okay. So I had each of my four boys pick out a marble uh -huh. here. So I got some reds, a blue, and uh, Ooh, some kind of shiny one. Yeah, that one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the fiery one picked like that pearl. one. <laughs> and these viruses are always trying to get in. They're funded by organized okay. crime. They are paying virus writers and hackers to try to get in. And virus, antivirus is going to block most of them. So that's great. That's why you need it. But inevitably, these guys are going to get in. Okay. So viruses wow. get in. And then at this point, we have 
a running computer. It's live. So I'm going to ask you to help me out, if you don't mind, sure. by shaking this around a bit to show that when the computer is running, the virus files, so the good files and the bad files, they're active. They're able to move and hide and fight back. So when antivirus, which is also running on top of this running computer, tries to go in, it's trying to pick out files that are moving and able to hide and fight back. Oh. So it's very difficult for antivirus to get them off. Oh, okay, I so see. antivirus will prevent most from getting in. Once they get in, really hard to get them off. So why Fix Music is different is the first thing it does is shut down the computer. Okay? So all the files, the good files and the bad files, settle down, they rest. And at this point, we have the Fix Me Stick plugged into the computer. Mm -hmm. And since all the files are dormant, they're not hiding. So Fix Me Stick is very easy, easily able to take off each file. So it takes off here, it's got a good file. It's able to pass it through the Fix Me Stick, pass it through three virus scanners that we've licensed from three of the world's largest security companies. And it determines that that file was a good file. So it puts it back. Eventually it gets to a bad file. It scans it and either one, two, or three of the virus engines will determine that it's bad and Fix Me Stick will take it off. It'll go through every single file and run every single file through three scanners. So that's why it takes a long time. Exactly. So if it takes three hours, if it takes four hours, you know what? It's doing its job. Exactly. Don't worry about it. Go, go to, to sleep. sleep. Go to sleep and then wake up knowing that you're completely protected. Exactly. So the Fix Me Stick then this reboots so your good. computer back into Windows. Mm -hmm. You're off to the races with the computer like the day you bought it. Okay, so the question is, how did you come up with this? <laughs> how did you do so, this? So we have been working, have, I mean, we've been working in antivirus right. for many, many years, and we saw that viruses were getting by. At the same time, we saw that techies had a solution. They had something called a rescue disc or a boot CD. Exactly, this was a, a rescue CD, disc. A rescue right. disc. I this was that. a CD that people would pop into computers mm -hmm. when they used to have CD slots. Yes. And they would reboot the computer from this rescue CD, and they would clean the computer off. The problem was it, was, it was good for techies, they could use it, but it was very complicated to use. So my mother, people like my mother, who are basic computer users, didn't use it. And this was the opportunity that Marty, my partner, and I saw. We saw that there is a solution out there, it's just too difficult for the masses. And so mm -hmm. we quit our job in, tw in 2011 and set out to take this proven approach, this problem, make it easy to use, and bring it to market. How did you get to the Dragon's Den? How did that, all process, that process so, all happen? So that was a lot of fun. So basically, we lined up at Concordia University, woke up at about 6 a.m., got in line, and you have to get in line, and eventually, you know, they will see a certain number of people, and if you're at the back of the line, you don't get in. So we got there early, got in line, pitched it to the producers. They liked the idea. So then about six months later, we got to actually go on the show, and we pitched to the five dragons, and all five actually gave us did they have, an offer. Did you have their attention just like that? We pretty much mm -hmm. did. I mean, it's pretty yeah. amazing. So they have no idea the dragons going right. in, what the companies are. Right. So they've got, they hear your pitch and they've got to be pretty smart to sort of yeah. pick it up, Sometimes understand Sometimes you it. can tell when they become interested, they all start to yeah. lean forward. <laughs> you know, they, they definitely seem pants. interested yeah. very quickly. Right. I mean, I was pretty nervous. So I was inside wow. my brain thinking about myself a lot. But yeah, looking back and watching it after, mm -hmm. they, they were pretty engaged right away. Well, you know, congratulated. Uh, Congratulations to you, and thank you so much for bringing the Fix Me Stick to the shopping town. Now, we've had it here a number of times. Yeah. It's sold out every single time. We have, it, we're well over 8,100 sold out earlier today. We were able to get in a few thousand more. I don't know how long it's going to last, but if you didn't watch last night with the 10 o'clock hour, I'm watching you and Carrie last night. I'm going, oh, man, this is going to sell out before I even get to work. Um, I was getting texts, uh, could you order this for me? And I'm writing back and saying, I think you better order it yourself because I don't think there are going to be any left by the time I get there. So let's talk about the value again because $79.99, when you think about it, I'd pay, I, I, you know, I would pay hundreds of dollars for each time you have each a problem. Each time you have a problem That's for right. everything that the Fix Me Stick is going to do. Yeah. But one time, seventy-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents for the for a lifetime, five computers, and the Fix Me Sticks that that you are seeing out in retail, still great value, absolutely fantastic. By the way, three computers, which is still fantastic. 
but you're still paying for a renewal. I think it's about $44.95, something like that. That's exactly is that right. Yeah. The version that's in all retail yes. stores in North America, you're going to pay renewals every single, every year, single year, $45. Okay, here, let's take... Yeah, exclusively yeah. here, exclusive. lifetime, no renewals, Wonderful. only place in Canada to get it. That's it. All right, let's take a listen to uh, these great testimonials. When I first started using the Fix Me Stick, I used it on my computers, I tried it on friends' computers. Every single one of them had some sort of malware, even though they had virus protection up front, and the Fix Me Stick was able to clear all of them out. I have three kids who are always downloading games that can have viruses that can really slow down the computer. With the Fix Me Stick, I plug it in and I can fix the problem myself. The Fix Me Stick is really easy to use. It automatically stays up to date, there is no software to install, and no password to remember. Just plug it in, let it do its job, and then store it for the next time you need it. I bought Fix Me Stick for home use, and it worked so well, I brought it to the office and I gave it to our IT department. Now they're using it to fix viruses they couldn't fix before without it. I love Fix Me Stick customer service because I can call them, reach another person at the end of the line who's helpful, friendly, and explains things to me in a way that I understand them. You know, I just love listening to these people. I mean, these are real people just like you and me. And I love the fact that the, uh, the one fellow said that he had, he, he had taken it to work to his IT department. And um, a lot the, of IT the department Fix Me people. Stick is getting rid of viruses that the IT department uh, couldn't get rid of. Isn't that where we go yeah, for help? I mean, they now. do a great job, but I, my gosh, I mean, look at what you've done. Do you want to actually show our viewers yeah. exactly how to use this again? Yeah, I'll just show you how, yeah. how easy this is to use. So we have the Fix Me Stick plugged into the side of the computer here. So it's yes. got a little light on the side here so you can tell it's plugged in. And then when you plug it in, this window pops up which kind of guides you through what's gonna happen. Okay. okay. So there's five steps. So the first step is once you click reboot and start Fix Me Stick, your computer's gonna reboot. So okay. that's really the critical difference between Fix Me Stick and all other solutions. The Fix Me Stick is gonna scan your computer while the main system is off. So all viruses are dormant and they can't hide and fight back. So number two, a black screen pops up that shows the Fix Me Stick is starting. Then we got the Fix Me Stick logo. Then the Fix Me Stick guides you through its six scanning steps that you'll see in a minute. And finally, you got your results. So step six, results, either you're clean and you have that peace of mind or you're not clean and you're gonna have one click to clean it all up. Okay, so all you have to do to show you how simple this is, is click this one button. Okay, you see the little fix man there with his cape? <laughs> yeah. So we wore capes on Dragon's oh Den. We God. felt dorky, but Marty and I wore capes. Did they kind of look at you sideways when you first they, came in? They did. They were wondering <laughs> if we were sort of a serious bunch or not serious. Anyways, now Fix Me Stick takes over. It's going to reboot, and now it'll take some time, but there's nothing else to do. We can come back and check in on it in a few minutes, and I'll show you the, the steps and where it's at. Okay, so you were talking about your mom. Yeah. Yeah. Did your mom get a chance to use it? Yeah, let me tell you that story. So um, my mom used to often invite me over for dinner. She's a great cook. <laughs> and about two weeks after we had our first prototype for Fix Me Stick, I got a call. I was invited over for dinner. And my mom said, oh, if you don't mind, Corey, could you come over an hour earlier or so and look at my computer because I have an issue. So this, you know, this request was made from time to time. And of course, I'm happy to oblige. Of course, it's my mom. Your mom. <laughs> so I thought this is my opportunity. I wanted to see if my mom could actually use the Fix Me Stick because we were trying to design something extremely easy to use. So we didn't have a uh, fancy stick at that point, but we got a, a USB drive at the corner computer store, loaded Fix Me Stick on it. And I brought it over, went early to my mom's house, sat down and said, you know what, mom, I'm here early, but I'm actually not going to fix your computer. Instead, we're going to hang out and enjoy each other's company, and I'm going to leave this product here for you to fix the computer. What'd she say? She was not happy. <laughs> <laughs> so she had tried downloading solutions in the past and fixing things. She was worried she was going to screw up her computer. It wouldn't work. It was going to waste her time. And I said, mom, I have, well, I had three boys at the time. I have four now. I have three boys. I've quit my job. I've been trying to, been unemployed, basically trying to start this company for a year. Give me the benefit of the doubt and try it. I <laughs> said, okay, of course I will. Now, I didn't want to taint the test, so I didn't want to tell her a whole lot about the product. Okay. I told her these exact steps. It wasn't printed on the back, because again, we didn't have a nice key yet. Right. But I told her these simple steps. I said, mom, take off the cap, plug it in, double click run, fix me stick, let me know what you think. So we had a great dinner. I didn't spend the whole evening up in the computer room. We enjoyed ourselves, went to bed. In the morning, I got the call, and I was, you know, I was nervous. I wanted to hear what, what she thought. 
and she was so proud and felt so empowered, she'd actually cleaned it herself. herself. And she yeah. said at that moment, Corey, I think you might be onto something here. Oh my gosh. And that was how long ago then? That was in but 2012. 2012. So three years okay. Ago. All right. Now I'm going to ask you a question because it keeps running through my head. All right. So this is a lifetime of five PCs. A lifetime of five PCs. Now, you also said that there are new viruses, like about a million of them, every day. Every day. Anyway. How does the Fix Me Stick keep up with all that? Yeah, great question. Because if the Fix Me Stick couldn't keep up, if you just bought it one day here, let's say, and yes. it never updated itself, yes. it would pretty much be useless within days. For sure. Because the virus is always changing. So the Fix Me Stick, the minute, let's go back a sec. Okay. When a virus gets on an infected computer, it often interferes with the internet connection. So if your internet connection is not working great, it could be because there's a virus on there and it's interfering to try to block virus updates to your antivirus engine. Okay. So anyways, the Fix Me Stick reboots your computer into its own environment and at that stage viruses are inactive and the Fix Me Stick is able to use your existing Wi-Fi or wired connection to download all the latest updates from our server. And again, it's able to do that while viruses are inactive, so they're not interfering. So even if your main system can't get a connection, the Fix Me Stick is more likely to be able to. All right, now I have another question, because, and it's because of um, a, a TV program that I, I saw once where people are constantly taking their laptops and they're going to coffee shops and they're using their Wi-Fi uh, connection. And I had heard that that is a very common place for people to actually get viruses because is that yes. is that so it's it's dangerous you have to, it's if, you're, danger. if you're careful yes. and you know what you're doing you're fine but it depends on your firewall settings and things that you a lot of people don't really know how to manage on their computers yes. so there's a risk depending on how your computer's set up okay all right so yeah. take note of that all right so we're at 8300 um lines are still very very busy from last night 10 p.m. with Corey and Carrie Oliver. Please get on the telephone lines. You know, if you're having a problem with the computer, you definitely need a Fix Me Stick. If you're thinking, well, you know, my computer seems to be okay, you know what? You need a Fix Me Stick. You need to actually use it at least once a week just to keep yourself, keep that path so nice make and sure clear. You have that peace exactly. of mind. Exactly. And isn't that what you want when you think about identity theft? It is one of the biggest crimes out there. If you've known known anyone who has ever experienced that, it's pretty bad and it takes many, many years and many times you're not even able to recoup that. People don't realize how sophisticated viruses are. Yes. So virus writers are funded by organized crime. There's billions of dollars funding these people. There was a very interesting and dangerous virus called Zeus a few years ago. And what oh. Zeus did is it would get on your computer, it would be completely silent so you wouldn't know it was there, and it would wait for you to enter your banking information, mm. and then it would steal money from your bank account. Oh my gosh. Now that in itself is not that unique. There's a lot of oh. viruses that are designed to uh, steal banking, steal information from your, steal your banking information and then take yes. your money out of your bank account. What was unique in this case was Zeus would stay on your computer, and when you later went in to log into your bank account to take a look, it would actually rewrite your bank balance so you wouldn't see the money it took out until you actually received either Are you know the, you the, the paper summary in the mail if you still get that or you eventually started bouncing checks wow and the worst thing is okay. in this case it wasn't there was no pop-ups it wasn't slowing down the computer because it didn't want to tip you off that it was there so all this is to say it's very hard to know if you're infected and the fix me stick is the best way to do an extremely deep scan and know if you're clean. Yeah, you have to get one step ahead of them yeah. because they are very, very smart, aren't they? And, and you know, with technology that's out there, I mean, the criminals, I mean, they're right up there. They know exactly what's going on. They've got a lot of money, on. yeah. Let's take a look, actually, of, uh, at this video. What should you do when your computer gets <coughs> sick? Computer viruses happen to everyone, and they're painfully difficult to detect <laughs> and remove, leaving your banking and other personal data at risk. You don't have time to call your technical friends or take your computer to the shop. How great would it be if you could confidently and quickly fix your own PC and keep it that way? You can with a tool that the computer experts use, the Fix Me Stick. The Fix Me Stick scans your computer while it's sleeping, so the viruses are sleeping too. They can't run and hide the way they do from other solutions. Oh, and it's packed with not one, but three of the best antivirus engines in the world. So it finds and fixes your virus problems fast. 
The Fix Me Stick is ready to go right out of the box with no additional software or downloading required. So it's fast, simple, and because it runs separately from your PC, it can't mess up anything. Your files are safe. Make the Fix Me Stick your first response when there's a problem with your PC. See, I love that as well, Corey, um, because it runs separately from your PC, it's not going to, it's not going to mess up anything, whereby there are a lot of programs that if you hit the wrong button, sure. something is going to be amiss, isn't it? Yeah, can we go good. back yeah. over here to see what's happening? Yeah, I'm going to run you through what's happening here. So you can see here, there's no start menu, right? Windows right. is not running. There's no start menu. There's no files to look at. This has rebooted your computer entirely from a system on this Fix Me Stick right here. And it's, we haven't touched it, right? We double clicked Run Fix Me Stick, and then we didn't do a thing. Now it tells you all the steps it's going through if you're interested to look at it. The first step was checking an internet connection, uh -huh. and then checking for product updates. So okay. we said that's really important to go update all the definitions because viruses are changing. As we said, a, over a million new viruses a day this year, and it was only 300,000 new viruses a day three years ago. So it's growing and growing and growing. And then we initialize the malware scanners. Mm -hmm. And then this is the step that takes a long time. So this is scanning the computer. So this could take three hours, four hours, three, five, four, five, up to on, six, yeah. seven. You know, it's a long time. Yeah, just to go let to it sleep. go. It's scanning okay. every single file with not one, not two, but three antivirus engines so you can be sure you're clean or if you're infected, we can clean it off. So this is step five. Then when it's done, you're going to be at step six, which is the results screen. So most of our users go to sleep at night wake up in the morning and the fixing stick sits right on the results screen and that screen will either say you're a okay good run another scan in a week to make sure you're clean to make sure you're still clean okay or it'll give you a complete list of all the infections that were found so some of our users like to see that list you can go google it and see what it was mm -hmm. others really don't care and yeah. just click the one fix button to clean up the computer i think that's what i'd be doing <laughs> click i don't want to see it <laughs> And okay. so then the Fix Me Stick reboots your computer right back into Windows, and you're off to the races with a computer like the day you got it. Okay, now what does this mean, custom scan for advanced users? So if advanced users think there might be an issue in a certain part of their computer, they can customize okay. that. Most of our users don't use that. Most of our users are fairly okay. non-technical. Right, just they just regular. go through the basic step. Yeah. Okay, great. Yeah. All right, again, here it is, lifetime. Look at this, lifetime of five PCs. So you could have five PCs in the house. You could have, you could have um, a laptop, you can have a desktop, you can, uh, you can loan, yeah, parent, yeah, exactly, up to five for the lifetime, and all you paid was $79.99, or you got it at home for $19.99, one payment, and started using it immediately. I mean, I, 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 I just can't wait. I, I just think this is the best thing that I've ever seen. I want to read a couple more. Would you yep. mind if I did that? Okay, so... Plugged it in, took about three hours to scan, but found, but it found so many viruses. Oh, my God, butterflies in my stomach reading that. My computer performs so much faster now, so for that reason alone, I would recommend this product. Didn't have to cart my heavy hard drive out to the repair shop. I've done that before at a cost of $130 each time. So this stick has paid for itself already. There's and not only the cost when you have to bring in your computer, but it's well, very inconvenient. You're without a computer for a couple of days, bringing it into the store, right. and then all your personal information well, is on there. Some people it. aren't comfortable with that. I'm not comfortable with that at all, and I think most people aren't. All right, my computer, these are all five-star reviews, by the way. My computer runs like a new one after Fix Me Stick. It takes five hours to clean it up, but well worth the time and money save. Okay, that was that computer, five, time, five hours. We had one that was three and a half hours. It could be five, it could be, it depends on what your computer needs. So yeah, how many me. files you have, the speed of your computer, that kind yeah. of stuff. And uh, okay, I was running, um, I was running McAfee, uh, which I, uh, which it said was all clear, but this found 12 infections and my PC is running much faster now. I still had a pop-up after running the stick. I called the 1-800 number and was shocked when they said they'd remote connect for free and clean it up. Wow. Super impressed. Great product, TSC. Thank you very much. And well, you know, if you want, if you want to make sure that you're safe, if you want to make sure that all of the computers in, in the house are safe, you have a desktop or whether they are laptops, you have a couple of friends that you'd like to loan it out to, for the lifetime of the PC, 
for $79.99. You must like this a lot because that's a great, that's a <laughs> it's, great it's deal. It's a great deal. When you compare it to yeah. the version that's available yeah. in all retail yeah. stores in North America. Which is still well worth it for everything that it does. Yeah. Yes, it is. You're going to pay $60 there, and that's going to cover three PCs for a year, and then you're going to have to pay $45 per year every year thereafter. Still a great deal, but you compare that to here, where you're paying under $80 once, and this is covering not three, but five computers, and you're never going to pay a renewal cent ever again. Never okay. call your credit card. Now, all computers, all brands? Yeah, any Windows computer, okay? Any Windows? So any okay. Windows computer that has a USB slot, so that's pretty much any Windows computer in the past 20 years, can have XP, Vista, 7, 8, 10, pretty much any computer that's not a Mac. We're working on a okay. Mac version, not ready yet. Okay, all right, line's busy, 8,500 sold. Um, and again, very, very quickly, um, tell us how the Fix Me Stick is different from any other antivirus program. Okay, so antivirus is good. A lot of people ask us that. They say, well, I have an antivirus program and it's up to date, so why do I need the Fix Me Stick? And the reality is you need both. Okay. okay, so antivirus is good at preventing infection. Okay. And it will block most viruses from getting through, and that's what you want. You don't want a virus to get through in the first place. So you need to keep your antivirus up to date, that's good. The problem is, virus writers are funded by billions of dollars of organized crime, and they inevitably find a way by the antivirus, and they get in. Once they're in, antivirus has a hell of a time getting them off. And that's because the viruses are on the computer, so they're active. They're able to hide, they're able to fight back, they're able to disable the antivirus. And so you need a different approach. And the Fix Me Stick is a different approach. It's completely different than antivirus because the first thing the Fix Me Stick does is shut down your computer. Okay, completely turns it off and reboots your computer from a system on the stick. And why that's important is because that means all the good files and the bad files on your computer are inactive when the Fix Me Stick is scanning. So they can't hide, they can't fight back. The Fix Me Stick's able to very simply pick each and every file off, scan it, and determine if it's good or bad. Can we do that little demo again? Yeah, sure, this helps yeah. explain it. So I have brought in my son's Marvel collection here, and all of these clean files here represent, oh sorry, all these clear marbles here represent the clean files on your computer. So these might be your Windows system files, these might be your wedding video, your pictures, all sort of stuff like that. And then what I have here are three, sorry, four colored marbles, that each of my four boys picked out to represent the viruses. Okay. okay. And this cage around here is the antivirus. So antivirus is good, you need it. It's gonna block most of the viruses from getting in. So they'll try to get in and antivirus is rejecting them. But inevitably, the virus writers are very well funded and they find a way by and slip in. Okay, so now we have four viruses that have got by the antivirus and they're on the computer. So okay. here's where I need your help. When a computer is running, Okay, it's active, all the files are active. So that means the files, they can move, they can hide, they can fight with antivirus. Antivirus is running on the same computer with all these files, it's on a level playing field, and it's very hard for antivirus to find these files because they're moving and hiding. So antivirus tries to come in, it can't quite get them. Fix Me Stick takes a novel and different approach, which is that the very first step is to shut it down. Okay, okay so I'm gonna put this down. Fix now it shuts down the computer, the marbles settle down, eventually. <laughs> yeah, they've settled there down. And now at this stage, the Fix Me Stick is plugged into the computer, and since the marbles have settled down, they're not able to hide. That's the critical difference with every other antivirus solution. So they've settled down, Fix Me Stick is able to take each file off, scan it with not one, not two, but three of the world's leading antivirus engines that we've incorporated on this stick. You don't see them, they're behind the scenes, but there's three of the world's best antivirus engines on the stick. So it scans the file, sees it's good, puts it back. Eventually it gets to the bad files, it scans them, and either one, two, or three of the engines flags that file as bad, so Fix Me Stick takes them off, and it is very easy for Fix Me Stick because all these files are inactive. It's got all four off, it reboots your computer back into Windows, you're off to the races with the computer like the day you bought it. Did you do this demo for the Dragons? No. No? This, we didn't I mean, think of this back then. I wish we had. completely <laughs> got me. You yeah, know, this absolutely. This took time to develop this Wow. Idea. I mean, and it's, it, you know, and it really does 
really, really does show you exactly what's happening. We're going to come back in just a moment. Do stay on the telephone. Um, order one for yourself. Order one for a friend as well. Give us a call at one 2020 $20, $20, Lifetime of five PCs, and all you pay is at one price of $79.99 or four easy pays of $19.99. Let's take a look. We'll be back in just a couple of moments. Let's get social. Join TSC on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. Stay connected with hosts and guest experts, make new friends, and discover something new every single day. Learn first about exclusive offers and contests, and get sneak peeks of TSC behind the scenes. Share your favorite recipes and get how-to tips. There's all this and so much more when you get social with TSC. Spring is in the air, Canada. I just know you're going to love my Today Show Stopper. It's my new longer cardigan with side slits and pockets. That's the perfect transition piece to take you from the cold winter months right into the spring and summer. I think it's the perfect luxury basic cardigan for the season. Shop for it online at tsc.ca this Monday exclusively at the Shopping Channel. Discover great value every day on the go at the Shopping Channel with our new Shop TSC app for iPhone and iPad. Search, browse, and shop hundreds of favorite brands anytime. Live stream our broadcast and watch product videos for informative and engaging demos. And stay in the know about our newest offers with alerts straight to your phone. Download our new Shop TSC mobile app at the App Store today. Make your next trip an organized and easy one with Hayes. The three-piece Zeus luggage set is stronger and lighter than traditional spinners from the brand and is available in seven trend-setting colors. It's our Today Showstopper Sunday. Hello there. I just want to quickly mention that um, we're having a birthday party, 29 years right here at the Shopping Channel. We have a great contest as well. You can win a $2,900 shopping spree plus one of 15 prizes. All you have to do is go to um, enter at tsc.ca slash birthday and get in on the birthday uh, just the birthday bash. We're having a ball. We know what those wonderful prizes are going to be. And uh, I'll tell you, it's going to be fabulous, absolutely fabulous. Do stay on the telephone lines. Please don't go away. We are with our Today Show Stopper. And um, Corey Villan is the um, co-founder, or co-founder, yep. can we say? Because you do have exactly a partner, right. a business yep. partner, partner that works with you. Yep. Um, he came up with such an amazing idea. It's called the Fix Me Stick. But... This is from years and years of experience as well and knowledge. Can, we, can you talk to our viewers about that? Yeah, sure. Just your background. Sure. Yep, yep. So I studied engineering. I did my undergrad at Queens and then did a master's degree at Stanford in the U.S. and then came back. I actually got hired as an intern by Marty, my business partner. Wow. And we worked for an antivirus company. So we built an antivirus product and sold it. Rogers was one of our biggest customers. Right. So this antivirus product was used by millions of home users throughout Canada, the US, and the UK. And we saw that even though we had a very good antivirus product, viruses were getting by. They weren't just getting by our product, they were getting by all antivirus products. And once viruses got onto the computer, they were painfully difficult to remove. So antivirus was fairly effective at preventing them from getting in, but once they got in, they weren't very effective at removing them. At the same time, Marty and I knew that techies had a solution. Techies had a solution called a rescue disk or a boot CD. Yes. They'd burn a CD, they'd pop it into the older computers that used to have a, a CD oh. drive, and they would reboot the computer from this CD, and the computer would be clean. The problem was it was really hard to use. So no non-techies were able to use it. Mm -hmm. So this is where we saw the opportunity. Marty and I decided to quit our jobs in 2011 yeah. and try to take this proven technology that techies had used for years and make it extremely simple to use. And by simple to use, I mean we put the instructions on the back of the key here. Okay? The first step is to take the cap off. Okay? That instruction is not on here. But the second step is simply to pop it into your computer and next double click run fix me stick. And we showed that a few minutes ago how it's that simple. Then the fix me stick takes over. It reboots your computer. So the first step it turns off your computer. That deactivates all the viruses. 
Then it restarts the computer from a system we've put on this stick. It takes over, it runs, scans every single file on your computer and restores it to like the day you bought it. When I say there's no other steps, you know, a lot of software programs you buy, you end up having to enter a code to activate yes, it, right? Exactly. So initially when we started building this, that was one of the ways we had for mm -hmm. activation. But we really wanted to make this simple. People would lose the codes, mistype them, they wouldn't work, and that was a pain. So we actually built the code right into the Fix Me stick so you don't have to remember it. So there's a code right here on the Fix Me stick. Right. And there's also actually a matching code on the internals of the Fix Me stick. So the Fix Me stick knows which Fix Me stick it is. You don't have to tell it. You to so when you run it, it just runs. There's no code. Stuff. It's very, very simple to use. My mom uses it, and it was designed for non-technical people to be empowered, to be able to clean the computers from the safety of their own home without having to pack it up, bring it to the corner. Or go and buy another one because sure. you think, you know, it's absolutely done. If you have a computer that's about, t say, even 10 years old, and it might be in the corner of the office, it might be downstairs in the basement, you think, well, you know, that thing is so, um, so slow. There's absolutely nothing, nothing I can do, and I really don't want to take it out because I've got a lot of, you know, really sensitive information on the computer. The Fix Me Stick can actually help that computer. Yep. You know, I heard you talking to Carrie last night because she was telling you that she had, uh, you know, that old Manila <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> computer. So I saw her in the office today. I haven't seen Carrie for a while. I said, okay, so Carrie, tell me about that computer that you had. She said, Greta, I'm telling you, my, she says, hand to, hand to the sky. She said, that thing works like a charm. She said, I wasn't, I didn't know if it was going to, but it was absolutely perfect. And yep. she's since it's, loaned it's it out too. A yeah. lot of people think mm -hmm. that computers are just naturally going to get slower over time right. and they give up on the computer and they buy a new one. That might cost you what, five, 600 bucks sure. for a cheap one, well over a thousand bucks. You don't have to. Give the Fix Me Stick a try. Worst case, you can try it and return it within 30 days. That's it. Give it a try. In many, many cases, it'll restore it back yeah. to like new. But then again, you've got a 1-800 number. Yep. So therefore, you can call the 1-800 number, free, amazing customer support. So if you use the Fix Me Stick and you think, well, I don't know, I'm, I, I, I'm not sure if it has actually done what Corey's telling me about, what will you do? Yeah, so if you call us, we have Montreal-based technical support. It's all in our office in Live Montreal. people. Live people. Do you ever answer the nice phone? Nice people. When <laughs> we're swamped, I answer the phone. In the early Great. days, I answered the phone all the time. Now when we're swamped, I answer the phone. I guess you did. And we don't, you know, sometimes technical support will make you feel a bit, you know, unworthy or something. Yeah. We do not do that. We're very helpful. We're happy to have you as customers, and we'll guide you through any problems. We'll even go as far, let's say you run a scan, and you think you're still infected for some reason. We will offer, again, free of charge, if you want us to, to remote connect to your computer, take wow. a look, clean it up, and since you've paid for a lifetime subscription, we'll never ask you to take your credit card out. How long was your, um, actually, when you went to the Dragon's Den, how long was that? Was it like, um, was that a half an hour that when you had? Air. So that's interesting, because they always trim it down, right? So when yes. they, if, you, if you go online and watch the show, it was actually about eight minutes. But it was really about 40 minutes of filming. Okay. And I would love to see the original footage oh, from that my because gosh, my yeah. brain was spinning. I don't Had remember to. half the things we said. I'd right. love to watch it, but we can't. So we only have the eight minutes that everybody else can yeah. see. And how long did it take for them to actually, like, you know, like I was saying, lean forward like, wow, <laughs> wow. These it guys was, have, are, are really onto something. Yeah. It was pretty quick. They were pretty engaged from the start. Yeah. They ask great there, questions. Like they, are, they are extremely smart. Sure. And they're not prepped beforehand on Dragon's End. They don't know you're coming in and they don't study the industry. Well, they don't, and they I are didn't cold. Know that. Yeah, they okay. are cold. So they are they're pretty smart, smart business people to pick up so quickly on such a broad range of things. For sure. Okay. So for our viewers who have just tuned into the yeah. shopping channel again, let's take a look. Yeah. So you've got it, you've got it. Yes, yeah, so what we did here to start the scan. In we the USB. Popped, we popped in the Fix Me Stick here, and then a window popped up. We double clicked Run Fix Me Stick, and that oh. was it. The Fix Me Stick took over. Yeah. yeah, you've got it scanning here. So the Fix Me Stick took over, rebooted the computer. You've got no start menu here because Windows is not running, okay? This is now the Fix Me Stick environment. Since Windows is not running, any virus that happens to be on the computer is not running either, and that's why Fix Me Stick is able to take them off very easily. They're not live. They can't hide or fight back. So after you've clicked Run Fix Me Stick, there's actually nothing else to do. This shows you the steps, but you don't have to do anything. Most of our users go to bed. 
The steps are first checking for an internet connection. Mm -hmm. So the Fix Me Stick will reuse your existing wired or wireless internet. You don't even have to remember your wireless password. The Fix Me Stick takes that off your computer and then puts it into the Fix Me Stick environment, uses your existing Wi Fi or wired connection. It downloads all the latest virus definitions, which is critical because there's over a million new viruses released every day. Every day. Every day. Every day and growing. So the Fix Me Stick gets all these definitions so it knows how to figure out if a file is good or bad. It initializes the malware scanners. And then step five is the one where Fix Me Stick spends all its time. So it's going to pick every single file, good or bad, off your computer and scan it with not one, not two, but three of the world's leading virus, antivirus engines to see if the file's good or bad. It'll put back all the good ones, take off all the bad ones, and then leave you on the results screen. So most users have gone to sleep, right? Because this takes mm -hmm. hours to run. They come back and they're on step six with the results. And either the Fix Me Six is going to say, you're good to go, and you have the peace of mind to know that you're safe and secure, or it's going to show you the entire list of malware that was on your computer. You can dig through it if you're curious. You don't need to. There's one button to click to clean everything off. All right, now I asked you this, um, this question earlier, but for our viewers who have just tuned in, with one million viruses that are created every day, how does the Fix Me Stick update itself? So it's a great question. So we've partnered with three of the world's leading security companies, and we license from them all of these virus definitions. So every time the stick runs, the first thing it does is connect to our servers, download all these virus yeah. definitions. It's all in the background. You don't see mm -hmm. it, but that's, that's what's happening. Downloads all these virus definitions and saves them onto the stick. It's important it saves them onto the stick because that means that, let's say, next time you run it, for whatever reason, you're not at home or you don't have internet anymore. If you don't have internet, the Fix Me Stick will still run. It'll run using all the definitions that it's saved on the stick from its last run. So it's better to have an internet connection because the Fix Me Stick will get the latest and greatest. But if you don't, we're not going to lock you out. Mm -hmm. It's still going to run with the definitions from last run. Okay, let's talk about the difference between the Fix Me Stick we have here as a Today Showstopper and the Fix Me Stick that we have out there in retail, which is a great buy. Yeah, you might. The Fix Me Stick is available in most retail yes. shops in Canada mm -hmm. and the U.S., so you might have seen it there. There's a big difference, though, between this exclusive offer here and what you have there. So in stores, you're going to pay $60, and it's going to cover three computers for a year. At the end of the year, you're going to pay another $45 every year to renew the subscription. Do we have that little comparison chart? We yeah, had let's it all day today. If we, can if we can get that up, please. So yeah, we compare. Both the retail version in stores and this version have automatic updates. That's important. You need the latest updates to take care of the latest viruses. All of our versions come with free tech support. And this is Montreal-based support with university grads you can talk to. We'll help you with any problem you have. Then we haven't even mentioned this yet. This version we have, just for today here, comes with one year of SOS online backup. So yes. it's another product bundled in. It will back up all of your files on your computer into the cloud for a whole year. That's very important because what if you have, God forbid, a fire in your house? What if a burglar takes your laptop? What if you pour coffee or wine into your computer by accident? All your files are backed up into the cloud. You can get them back. So that's exclusive, again, with this offer included, an $80 value. And that's included here okay. for free. Okay, and will that happen automatically, or is there something? Is there a button that we have to? There's a. It's a different in? product a that comes with. There's a product. card okay. you'll get here that has the, all the instructions. Gotcha. You install it, and you go. It's a okay, product. great. So I mean, you're getting even more than what we're talking about. Exactly, and then the the main mm -hmm. differences here to call out are the retail version is only going to work on three computers mm -hmm. for a year. Whereas this version, we're going to five computers for the lifetime of those computers. You are never yeah. going to pull out your credit card again. This is the only place in Canada to get the unlimited lifetime version. Let's take a look at the uh, testimonial video that we have. And uh, please remember to stay on the telephone lines. I mean, just listening to this information right now, I just want to run home and <laughs> I'll use the, the uh, Fix Me Stick right away. Take a look. I use it on my computers, I tried it on friends' computers. Every single one of them had some sort of malware, even though they had virus protection up front, and the Fix Me Stick was able to clear all of them out. I have three kids who are always downloading games that can have viruses that can really slow down the computer. With the Fix Me Stick, I plug it in and I can fix the problem myself. The Fix Me Stick is really easy to use. It automatically stays up to date, there is no software to install, and no password to remember. Just plug it in, let it do its job, and then store it for the next time you need it. 
I bought Fix Me Stick for home use, and it worked so well, I brought it to the office and I gave it to our IT department. Now they're using it to fix viruses they couldn't fix before without it. I love Fix Me Stick customer service because I can call them, reach another person at the end of the line who's helpful, friendly, and explains things to me in a way that I understand them. Now, isn't it nice to know that you can call someone and you can have a conversation with them? You don't feel intimidated whatsoever. They're going to help you out. And uh, with permission, you can take control of my computer. If, if, user if, wants I, us if, to, yeah. if uh, yeah, definitely. But you're getting all of this for one price under eighty dollars. The Fix Me Stick here at the Shopping Channel. You know, I've been hearing about it for a few. Well, probably you know, f three or four months from Bavish, who was uh, who was our buyer. I know he has it. He absolutely loves it. But this is new. This is the new one that is not in retail, only available right now at the Shopping Channel. Is yeah, that even the version that used to be yes. available at the Shopping Channel was only three computers. Right. And didn't right. come with the online exactly. backup. Exactly. So for the same price now, just for today. You got five computers plus the one you have online. Backup. Exactly. Killer you know, deal. if you don't love it, send it back to us. But are, are you kidding? Take a <laughs> chance. Take a chance. This is something that everyone needs. You can have three or four different computers in the house. And when you think about, you know, you think about all of the downloading of, you know, it could be movies. And I know a lot of kids, they're on, you know, on their computer. And I'm not blaming kids. We all do it. You know, we're getting on different websites. We don't know what's going on. We you don't might, know what's happening in the background. You might be very careful, but other people might use your computer. Kids often infect computers. They don't mean to, but they're clicking. They don't understand. And once viruses get on, the best viruses don't let you know they're there. So someone else in your family might have got it on, even if you're safe. That's why we recommend running the scan every week to make sure you're clean because you might not know you're infected. Yeah, you know, if you do have that one computer that the family uses, you want to make sure that you're using this. You don't know if the kids are, you know, downloading music or, you know, movies or what have you, but it could be absolutely anyone. And you talked about the fact that um, you could actually be helping yeah. organize crime. This is amazing what you said. Can you talk about that yeah. again, please? Yeah, there's a lot of viruses out there that will get installed on computers call home and then call home to organized crime headquarters and ask what to do and then organized crime can actually use your computer to execute whatever they want to do it might be attacking certain websites that they're going to try to extort to get money out of those websites so you'll have no idea but you might be you can google oh. botnet okay it's called a botnet you can botnet. be a part okay. of a botnet a system of computers working together for organized crime without you knowing really yep. Really? Okay. I know. Okay. So we're just about out of time. Over nine thousand. Please stay with us. You know, when you think about seventy-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents, how much would you pay actually to protect your your identity and the identity of your you know your your family and perhaps friends? Again, if you've n ever known anyone who has experienced um, uh, you know that kind of trauma, it's 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 pretty bad. I know two people. Thank you so much, Corey. Thank Such you for a having pleasure me. having you it's been here. Great. Thank you so much for being with us. And thank you so much for shopping with us. Line will remain busy. Carrie's going to take you shopping for the next couple of hours. Don't go away. Discover officially licensed NHL fan gear and collectibles at the Shopping Channel. Shop TSC.ca and discover everything you need for the ultimate hockey fan. Choose from a wide selection of jerseys, autographed pucks, mugs, toques, and so much more to get you in the game all season long. Get game ready. Shop online at tsc.ca slash NHL. And download our new app only at the Shopping Channel. Make your next trip an organized and easy one with Hayes. The three-piece Zeus luggage set is stronger and lighter than traditional spinners from the brand and is available in seven trend-setting colors. It's our today's showstopper, Sunday. Say hello to fabulous hands and nails all year long with our today's showstopper from Tips this Tuesday. Let one of the world's most iconic women in fashion inspire you from head to toe with the latest in design. Hi, I'm Jeannie Becker, style editor at the Shopping Channel. Join me as I share this season's stellar look and captivate you with all kinds of stories from the fashion world. Join us as Jeannie explores the world of fashion and style and shows us what matters. Tune in Thursdays at 8 for Style Matters with Jeannie Becker, only at the Shopping Channel.
Unlock the vault this Sunday and shop our most coveted jewelry items. Impeccable 14 and 18 karat gold designs set with a variety of genuine gemstones. Quantities are very limited, so if there's a piece you're after, act fast. Once they're gone, they're gone. Hayes is celebrating their 30th anniversary this year, and we've got the Today Showstopper to kick off the year. This is really exciting stuff because these, um, the pieces that we're going to do tonight is from the Zeus collection. Now, this is made of Duraflex, and Duraflex is something that's completely patented by Hayes, but it's five to 10% lighter than your average fashion spinner. So you've got superior lightweight, but you also have elasticity. Yeah, elasticity. So we're gonna talk more about that in just a moment, but let's go through the colors. 40% off, the value is extraordinary. And